I'm Tracy Pelashek with this morning's Kenosha News Minute sponsored by Festival Foods. A victim's family backed a lighter sentence for a man who claimed full responsibility in a June 8th fatal crash in Bristol. Christopher Orozco was sentenced to jail time and probation for homicide by drunken driving in the death of his good friend Brian Smith of Salem. The 20th annual Winterfest begins Saturday in Lake Geneva. The typical weekend event was extended for the entire week and includes events such as snow sculpting, bonfire, cocoa crawl, and human dog sled races. More than 30 Indian Trail art students are creating one-of-a-kind sculpture to be displayed at the new Amazon Fulfillment Center. The sculpture will be made from 40 cubic yards of Amazon scrap construction materials. Here's David Marin with sports. The UW Parkside men's basketball team upset number one ranked Indianapolis 72 to 68 before 1,760 fans at the D. Simone Gymnasium on Thursday. Parkside took a two to nothing lead and never trailed. For more, check KenoshaNews.com and pick up today's Kenosha News.